So this is a basic lesson on tens and ones. So let's start with our whole number. We can just use 45 for now. And we're going to subtract 1, 10. OK. First thing we need to know is how many ones are there in 110? Now we should know this. There are 10 ones in 110. OK, and we draw our tens just like this as one line. And these are our ones here. This is our ones. And this is our 10. OK, so to start properly, we need to draw out tens and ones chart. So tens and ones chart. And we want to draw our whole number. Now there are four tens in 45, and there are five ones. So we draw our four tens, and we draw our five ones. OK, now what I want to do is subtract 1, 10. OK, that's easy to do. I don't need to touch any of these ones here because I'm actually taking away 1, 10 straight away. So I'm just going to subtract 1, 10. Now I have my new answer, which is 10, 20, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 30, 5. So 45 subtract 10 is 35. Now, if we're wanting to subtract just ones, we start with 45 again. And let's say we're subtracting 3 for now. Again, we start with our tens and ones chart. And we draw our whole number out. 10, 20, 30, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now, because 3 is not greater than 5, it is less than 5, we can just take away 3 ones straight away, and we just cross them out like this. And then what we want to do is put a circle around our ones that are left, so we know that's what we're counting. So this one's nice and easy. We have 4 tens still. And we have two ones. So the answer is 42. Easy peasy. Next, we'll start with our whole number again. Go 45. We can use any number. It doesn't really matter. And we're going to subtract 8 this time. Well, we start with our tens and ones chart again. We draw out our whole number because it has four tens, five ones. Now this time we can't take eight away from this number because there are only five ones there. We can only take ones away from the amount of ones that are there. So we don't have enough ones here to take away eight ones. There are only five. So what we're going to do this time is we're going to come over to our friend in the tens and we're going to exchange one ten for ten ones. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We now have enough ones in here to take away eight ones because we have 15 ones all together now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. We have enough. We need to make sure, though, that we take away the 10 because we've exchanged it for 10 ones. The whole value together is the same, but we've taken away one 10 and exchanged it for 10 ones. Now let's take away our eight ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we want to draw a circle around the ones that are left so we can add those up nicely. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have seven ones and we have three tens left. So 45 subtract eight is 37. So it's really important we understand the keywords that we need to use here. 
we are exchanging exchanging one ten for ten once. That's really important. Okay, so that's the basics of subtraction. Hopefully you found that helpful. Um, anything you're confused with or anything you want to learn further, just write down in the comment below. And what I try and do is upload some more videos over the next few weeks. And hopefully that will help you get by.